point taste where you can drink these. You can drink these. You like gotta throw up to like make you burp. <laughs> oh! oh! He needs some milk. It's Hey, what is good, A team? It's your boy A T and my brother Drewski in the building. You feel me? Today, if you couldn't tell from the title, we got something special here, Conch. Hold on. It's that. It's that new Travis Scott uh, cacti agave spike seltzer. Now, I wanted to bring this to y'all. Excuse my nieces and nephews if y'all can hear that in the background, but um. I wanted to bring this to y'all because this is kind of limited, I would say, like nationwide. Now you can go to a this like site that has the the uh, the certain stores that that actually have this this a uh, drink in it. I literally stopped at like four stores earlier today. They did not have it. I stopped at the one store that was on the cacti site that said it was there. There was no store even there, so I stopped at the Seven Eleven that was next to it. They or I walked in, they had the uh, promo for it, but I went to the section, they had no drink in there, you feel me? One of the employees was uh, walking, I was like, bro, do y'all have that in here? He went to the to the back, checked, had, hey, they had the whole case, coach. I said, let me go ahead and check out with it. Now, somebody said they paid like 29 for this, and it's a nine pack. Now, this came up to $21 and some change for me, which is still a little bit, you feel me? I don't like to spend too much like that on something like this. If I'm going to spend 29 I need to be on some, like, actual liquor. You feel me? Put my water bottle man. over here in the cut. Here, now, I got me only, like, a good shot and a half or two, you feel me, um, that I'm going to take as we trying these. But just to start it off, let them know what we normally drink in as far as a can goes when we, you feel me, cha well, let's start it from the beginning. When we first started Who with the drink. What are we talking about? I'm talking about you drinking or me drinking. You know, I mean, you can tell them yours. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to tell them mine, too. I, I started off with the bag on four logos. You feel me? As far as cans go. Started uh, off with first the local, uh, four logo is my first can drink. Yep. Four, four, four loco. Then, um, what did I move into? I want to say it was Club Tales right after that. But yeah, you said you started where now? At the four locos and then in the what? Cans? Yeah, can wise. Cause I know it's a lot of people who like be on the like Bud Light, um what are those called? The Limeritas and like all that uh, stuff, strawberries. Yeah. I mean I've tried them but I don't like them. Yeah, those are I feel like they just kinda sweet. Yeah. I don't know. Like I mean I don't really drink beer though either, so um but like I've had the club tails, the um, they got a orange juice and vodka. If you go to the little corner stores. Actually, they got it at 7-Eleven, too. I'm not going to lie. My orange juice and vodka? Yeah. Who is that with? Um, I don't know. It's in, a, like, a, a glass bottle. Okay. But, um, but yeah, man, like I, I mean, that's where we started. Y'all get down in the comments. Let us know what y'all sipping on these days as far as... Uh, a like chaser type of drink you feel me because i feel like that's what this is i know some people drink stuff like this to actually get lit i know for us personally this is not gonna do the job this is like this is damn near like juice you feel me if it ain't got if it ain't your regular liquor this is damn near like juice not, <laughs> not 95 proof or higher i don't want it what what the fuck <laughs> i'm weak bro but either way we trying out all three of these A few moments later. But yeah, we're going to be trying out all three flavors of these today. They got pineapple, lime, strawberry. Um, I actually pulled up a little description here that they got or the story behind this. Uh, it says cacti, not iced tea. Or not cacti, not no iced tea. This is what Travis Scott shouts during the first verse of his most recent single, Franchise. Which, if y'all remember that, we actually did a reaction to the Franchise music video. He had this cacti drink. It was like promo in there and just random scenes. I didn't know where what it was at the uh, time. I didn't know it was supposed to be coming out, but randomly, I think I was on Twitter yesterday and a lot of people was talking about it. It had just came out. Um, so that's really what made me come with this review for y'all, for all the ones who might be wondering what it tastes like, that whole type of thing. Um, 
We're enclosed in the dorm with Cacti logo. Discover Cacti. All right, we ain't going to read all that off, but either way, it's Agave Spike Seltzer made with 100% premium blue agave from Mexico and natural flavors for a refreshing and bold taste. Nine cans. We're going to go ahead and crack these open. I wish I had opened it a little better than this, but hey. <laughs> you got your... You got your strawberry. I wanted to get brighter though, but my dad on light. Matter of fact, hold this one. Oh yeah, yeah, you can put it on there. You feel me? We got that strawberry right there. Now, let me go ahead and get y'all right so y'all can see what's going on here. I'm gonna just put them right on. Y'all. What is this? Pineapple right there. lime right there so strawberry pineapple lime ain't looking that bad ain't looking that bad all right but like i said it comes in nine cans uh this one specifically cost me 21 dollars at a 7-eleven i don't know if y'all have a 7-eleven near y'all or how that's going but um either way we're gonna be trying these out i'm gonna be pouring mine in this clear cup so y'all can see the actual color of it just if you're curious about that um but the club tails the bahama mama club tails this is what i've been on for who knows how long i don't know if you you still think i'm a slammer in the long island iced tea baby yeah because they got like what six <clears throat> different flavors they got a blue motorcycle a sunny margarita bahama mama you just named uh, off Alabama two. Slammer, the Long Island Ice Tea. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's about five. So yeah. I might got six. You know what I'm saying? So I, that, that's what I'm normally on. I normally chase a shot with that. So I'm gonna, first off, I'm going to go ahead and water for you. Um, I normally just chase my shot with another shot. Cap. <laughs> if you're chasing your shots with another shot, sir. <laughs> if you're taking... Tequila, what are you chasing it with? That's I just found you, out. You, I'm guessing straight coconut in. Coconut tequila. I just had that this past weekend. That was my first time having it. Uh, it tastes a lot better than regular tequila. Stays down a lot better. Uh, but it still catch you. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Hey, either way, we about to hop on into this strawberry first. I ain't getting nothing to rinse these off, but hey. We gotta do what we gotta do. And I was thinking about it. I'm like, bro, I'm about to try all three of these, man. We just gonna have three of these wide open. Oh, this is clear. I thought it would have been a little bit of a maybe a like red hue to it. But this is clear. I wonder if all of them are the same color and it's just a different flavor to them. Smell on it. It ain't bad. Let's go in and see what it's talking about. For me personally, I don't know what his thoughts is. It's not really too much flavor in that though. Yeah. Yeah, it's like it's. It's supposed to be like seltzer water. It is. Yeah, it is a seltzer. I'm tripping. I'm tripping. So that's that's. I wouldn't get that personally to chase. So really, I got six more of these. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I know I'm not drinking a strawberry one. Are, are you taking that with you? Are oh, we gonna end up pouring these out, Coach? That's tough. Are we hopping on into the, the pineapple we mix? Give them to somebody. Hmm? We could give them to somebody. Yeah, I'm sure somebody will take them. Hand them out on the side of the street or something. So all of these are clear, basically. I'm pretty sure the, the other one's going to be clear, too. Another one. What flat? Smell a little weird. I can smell the pineapple, but it's... No, it's I'm going to keep it a buck. I can tell that this, the, the lime can't be too much different. You feel me? It's, it's, <laughs> we just set the whole camera up for this. I bought, I spent $21 on these. Sir, this could have been a whole daggone bottle. <laughs> I mean, if you like seltzer, maybe you'll like it. Golly. On to the lime, bruh. These flavor is horrible. Now, Travis Scott, I, gotta, I mean, you got to shout out to him, though. As you see, another clear one. 
This is like Sprite from the actual look of it. But Travis Scott, he been he been on his thing. He's on these seltzers now. Of course, he did a collab with McDonald's. We did a food review to that Travis Scott meal. If y'all haven't seen that, I'll drop a link up there somewhere. But let's go ahead and see what this line I'm talking about. The smell on that is bad. Man. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm going to keep it a buck with y'all, <laughs> bro. No, <laughs> this is not it. <laughs> bro, this is not it whatsoever, bro. Travis. Travis. Did you taste these before these came out? Or what are we talking about? Like... I'm not even about to finish this to keep it honest with you. I We're, think that's how seltzers are supposed to taste. I yeah, think. I, th- I mean, I've, I've I've had a seltzer before, which I want to say might have been the. Um, I've only had like two. And I think one of those includes the seltzer water. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want to say mine might have. If it does, Sam happen? Does Samuel Adams have one? Or if not, it was a uh, a, a Bud Light one. That was something like it looked like it was a. Uh, Lime Rita or a strawberry Rita, but it wasn't, and it and it had a similar taste as that. So I guess that's what it's supposed I don't to know, be. Those just pass my eye when I'm walking by. You know what I'm saying, <laughs> like for for me personally, something like this, I would not just be looking for. Like I said, the club tails they got ten percent alcohol in it. They're smooth. You feel me? And they they still gonna get you right. They gonna get you right like a four loco. You feel me? You ain't gonna be t- twisted type it, but they gonna do the damn job. You feel me? And it's ten percent alcohol. I feel like you can't beat that. These here, somebody said for the damn tall cans, they pay like five dollars for it. For one tall can, you pay five dollars. I'm paying. I think it's what two and two fifty, maybe three for the club tail. And some some stores do the two for four, really. So I would be honest with y'all, bro. I mean, if you like a seltzer, try it out, maybe. Me, me personally, the actual taste on it is a no go, bro. I can't, I can't, I can't do it. So I got six more cans of these. Like I said, I will not be drinking these. I mean, either find a way to give them away, or I, I don't really know what to do. You feel me? Like maybe mix them with a, with a, with a regular liquor. I don't know. <laughs> but uh, if you got to rate this on a scale of one to ten, what you giving it? Actually, if you first, if you had to pick one as your fla- as your favorite flavor out of the lime, pineapple, strawberry, which one? And I would say the strawberry. That's that exactly the most flavor to it. Exactly. I'm like, and, and that's crazy because when we first tasted that, we both said, ah, it's not really too much flavor there. But, but that has These, the most I mean, flavor. The other two is just flat. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, bro. So the strawberry, I would recommend. I wouldn't recommend, but if you were gonna try one, I would say try the strawberry. That for sure has the most flavor out of all of these. But I mean, like I said, on any normal day, on any routine day, going to the store to get a a drink or a can is not gonna be this. Um, shouts out to Travis Scott for doing it, but sir, y'all got to do better than this. You feel me? I don't know what I don't know what the difference is. Seltzer, what would this be considered? Just a, just a club though. Yeah, like a um. A oh, pre- premium cocktail. Yeah, like a malt or something. Malt liquor or something. Like cocktail like in a, a can. Or yeah. Either way, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Either way, that was our review of the cacti. If anybody want one of these six, drop it in the comments. I'll try and send. I ain't gonna really send it to you, but. Like I said, I got six that are probably going to be just given away or just going to sit here until they too old to damn drink, bruh. But that was our review of these Travis Scott Cacti Agave Spiked Seltzer. Can't really say I recommend it. Oh, yeah, I, I didn't give you or um, yo, if you're going to rate it one through ten. Really, you can go separate, too, if you want to go strawberries this through ten, that through ten, or just... Overall, on what scale? On a drink scale, or just a like a seltzer scale? On a on a on a can on something you can get from Seven Eleven scale or from a gas station. Like I'm picking up late night. I'm on the I run. I would never pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a zero out of ten. <laughs> I mean, that's me. I just never. I would never pick up a seltzer in the first place. Like, 
But if the flavor was hitting, I feel like it might be at least like, all right, I'll give it a... Maybe I won't pick it up, but I'm yeah, saying... Yeah, but after we tasted it, it reminded me, and I was like, that's what I thought the last time that I tried a seltzer, and it was the same as seltzer water. That's tough, bro. Mm. Like, I feel like if you drink too much of these, you might be ready to throw up, no cap. Unless you that's just got the taste buds you can drink for these. It. You can drink these if you, like, gotta throw up to, like, make you burp. <laughs> And then, and then you don't have to throw up because you burp. What the hell? Is it that bad? Oh, okay, okay. He didn't say drink it to make you throw up, you feel me? But he said drink it to just make to you make burp. you burp. Yeah. Okay, I can see so that. you don't throw up. I said but, if you got to throw up, you drink it so you got to burp. But then, yeah, coach, I got to give it like a <laughs> one. Because I'm saying like even if somebody, if somebody gave me this drink, I would not drink it. I'm if, saying I feel like if you were... On a seltzer scale, if you were a seltzer person, then that's what I'm it saying. Might be like a seven or eight, but I'm not a seltzer person. That's what I'm saying. Like that's that that's the only difference. Like if if you're used to drinking seltzers, then maybe this would be good to you. But for somebody who doesn't really drink seltzers, because I was going into this like I saw it said agave spiked seltzer, but I didn't. It didn't really register me that that or register to me that it would taste like that even though i've had a salsa and like he said once you tasted it, it reminds you of that yeah it's like a i don't even know how to explain it bro but like i said if you're gonna try one try the strawberry out um if you've tried any of the other flavors y'all get down there in the comments let us know what y'all think about it you feel me let us know what y'all would rate it on a scale of one to ten i feel like it's gonna be somebody who like bro man y'all Y'all, y'all niggas tripping, bro. This is hitting. Like, oh. no. no. <laughs> that's what I said. That's what I said. So if you're a seltzer person, if that was a person that drunk seltzers, then they'd probably be like, yeah, bro, that joint was slapping cut. Like, or you just a Travis Scott fanatic. <laughs> 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 oh, no. Any bro. of Travis... T- <laughs> any of Travis Scott's top fans are going to be like, this it's the hidden. best thing ever. No, I still to try. Whenever everything opened back up, a Travis Scott concert, I bet they gonna have it stacked with these things, bro. Every nail, every every little opening you got to like where you could buy food or buy drinks, I can bet they gonna have them things there. I mean, but I was the same way with Wayne when I saw them with drinks in their video. They were like, oh, well, um, yeah. I was like, what, what, where they got the? I ain't seen these. Uh, I ain't seen these bottles in no videos before. Oh, hold on, I looked it up on the ABC site. I'm like, no, 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 they have none around here. <laughs> <laughs> is this exclusive to you, buddy? What going on? But yeah, man. Like I said, that was our review to to Travis Scott's new Cacti Agave Spike Seltzer. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed this. Uh, y'all get down there in the comments. Let us know what y'all thought about these. If y'all tried them, if you're 21 and up. I know I seen somebody in one of the comments of another video was like, I'm 17, but I can't wait to try these. <laughs> <laughs> the? I know, no, no, no. I condone on this channel. Exactly. Exactly. But wait, wait, but um, either way. <laughs> but either way, bro, y'all get down there in the comments. Let us know what y'all thought about the review as well as these seltzers themselves. If you've tried them, uh, let, let us know if y'all going to try them out if you haven't. Like I said, they, they are kind of pricey, um, but you already know our thoughts on it. We're not going out to purchase these again. The six that I have left are probably not going to get drunk unless they get mixed up in a different kind of concoction. That's probably the only way, but hey, man, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Um, if you did, be sure to smack that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hey, bro, we on the road to 20K subscribers. A hey, team, appreciate all the love y'all been showing so far. Let's keep it going. Keep it growing. Like I always say, y'all keep coming back, tuning in. I'm going to keep these videos rolling out. We're going to keep getting a lit over here. Catch y'all in the next video.